A kick out before the referee can get to one. Able to get that shoulder up so quickly. What a statement. Across the top rope, all the way to the floor. He is a sight to behold. Take a picture while you can, everyone. Got the leg. Bang and screw. That'll tear your knee up. This match grinding him down. Boom, up on an elbow. What are we going to see from Larkin? Look out. Oh, some breathing room. No good reason to stay in this right now. And tag. he's in now. Finally. And he fights it off. Really had less than a second to stay alive there. Oh, man. Consecutive attacks keeping Lorcan off his... out of it. Two. Major, major win. That'll change his career tonight. Here are your winners. AK-47 and Kushida. And a big time victory for this tag team here tonight. Gives you hope for the future of the tag division. Great tag team action on display, guys.
Hold on, Cameron Grimes isn't waiting for the match to start. Brian's opponent insulted him on social media. What do you expect? This is an overreaction to say the least. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring, representing the way. From San Francisco, California, weighing in at 270 pounds, AK-47. He was victorious in his last fight in MMA, but he was unable to reach a new agreement, so he decided to jump ship to sports entertainment. Well, when he requested a tryout at the Performance Center, the news got fans of MMA and WWE talking. Now we see what all the talk was about. So much money, it ain't even funny. Here comes the richest man in NXT history. Saxton, maybe you should ask Grimes for a little loan. You can update that suit game. You know what? That's not a bad and idea. And his opponent from Burlington, North Carolina, weighing in at 220 pounds, Cameron Grimes. A trainee of the Hardy Boys who is now rich enough to buy the whole Hardy compound. That's amazing to think about but actually a better reason to become friends with him. Maybe Cameron could buy somewhere for you to live so you can move out of your mom's basement. Hey, hey. Everything about Cameron Grimes is money. A diamond-encrusted hat on the inside. Saxon, that's why you're not allowed to touch Cameron's hat. Not even for like a minute? No. superstar to ever wear a hat. Can you blame Grimes for what he did? Uh, yeah, I can, and so did Grimes' mentor, Jeff Hardy. When the guy who trained you is calling you out, you clearly messed up. 
Whatever. Grimes is going to send his opponent to the moon again. And maybe this time you can go with him, Saxton. There he goes, right into the corner. Misses shoulder tackle in the corner. Mistake made by Grimes. <laughs> oh, what a punch. German suplex. Can he score the pin? Surprisingly quick kick out. These men knew this match was going to be hard fought. In. He's stalking his opponent from the top turnbuckle. Taking flight. Diving body splash. Looking for a high risk, high reward situation. Soaring. And nobody's there. Oh, stomping away. Ooh, stinging kick. Elusiveness for blocks. of counter. Cameron Grimes with the cave in. Grimes hits the referee. That's on the referee. He needs to be more aware when Grimes is about to send his opponent to the moon. Well, now it looks like Cameron Grimes is going to send his opponent a message with a baseball bat. It's Jeff Hardy. The charismatic enigma is here in NXT. But why? It appears he's trying to encourage his former student to take the high road here. What the heck? What was that all about? Now that's more like it. to the shocking actions from his so-called mentor, Jeff Hardy. Hey, you may not like how it went down, but at the end of the day, Jeff Hardy and Cameron Grimes are like family. And that means Hardy's gonna help Grimes get ahead in WWE, no matter what that entails. That's fine, but be upfront about it. Hardy was chastising Cameron Grimes on social media for using tactics like this, and then he turns around and does the same thing. Hopefully we'll get some kind of explanation from the charismatic Enigma before long.